Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial. Here I am discussing the formation of an oxbow lake. Oxbow lakes are formed at the old stage of the river or the lower course of the river where the river starts or is meandering. Are at the outer bank of the meander, erosion takes place while deposition takes place on the inner bank. For this reason, the outer bank of the meander is extended and the distance between the two outer banks is being reduced. Deposition is taking place on the inner bank, leading to formation of slip of slopes or point bars. For this reason, the resultant river here will be having a narrow narrow section because of the erosion and deposition. Let's see how the new river will appear. Because of erosion and deposition, the gap between the two outer banks will be reduced into a very, very narrow neck. That is the flow of the river. It is now taking a larger loop of the meander as it uh, flows downstream. In between the two outer bands, we have formation of a narrow neck and also the meander is extending outwards. Eventually what happens is that the river is likely to take a shortcut through that narrow neck and break it off. The neck is so narrow such that the current at the outer bank is likely to break it and the river will flow in a straight line. This one will enclose a pool of water and seal off the meander, this forming an oxbow lake. Thank you for watching.